The truth is you come to this channel because I do things differently. And even though everybody recommended the expensive knee guards, I got the Acerbis. Now why I got these? Because they are about $40. And I know you're gonna think, oh my God, $40, that must be cheap. They feel like quality in the box. I'm gonna put a link in the bottom of the video for this particular ones. Uh, they are one size fit all, which I like, uh, even though I have skinny legs. But I'm very, very curious to see what kind of a quality of service put into their knee guards because their plastics are pretty good. Finally, they're out. Whew. That took a while. And before you criticize me why I bought these, somebody has to try these things for you. And I am that guy. That's why you're coming to this channel. It's different. So this is what we got. This is the unit itself and it has a left and a right. So I like that because that means they're not uh, designed stupidly. Um, also, you see this piece of plastic, the big protection here in the front. It does not have any holes where things can go through and this was very, very important for me. I'd rather be a little bit more hot and have protection. I don't crash as much as cacti uh, try to go through. So this is very, very important for me. So there's a very, very open, uh, a little open space. Uh, as I said, these are Acerbis and this is the original Acerbis. This is not a bootleg. How does it fit on your leg? So this is my left leg and putting them on for the first time, obviously you have to adjust the straps. I tell you one thing, it's double hinged like the Liat's um, metal hinges over here. So these metal buttons over here seem to be metal all the way through. So this is super strong. I hope they're locked tight, so I'm not gonna lose them in the place. And as you can see, the knee itself, it's completely protected into the guard. But the design of it is absolutely uh, amazing as far as that goes. And here I am in my garage with my boots on and uh, the straps are on. Uh, then I put my pants on just so you could see better how they articulate. But so far they feel very, very nice in the boot. Actually, I, I could even uh, strap my boot a little bit um, uh, harder and Oh man, these have a very nice bend into them. Let's see how it's going to hug the motorcycle. Okay, with them on the motorcycle, um, they actually feel quite good. They are a little bit bulky, so it feels like they're missing a strap here in the back of the knee. So, you see how, how they get this way. Now, obviously, the pants will hold them. A little bit better if you have a, a pair of pants that are uh, quite uh, stretchy but I think that they should have just put an extra pair of lace like this on the back because they do have a tendency to open up a little bit like this if you were not wearing the right pants I do feel like I have very good control on the bike they don't feel very very bulky on the side it feels like the knee itself it's right in the right place. This little piece is where I'm controlling the bike with and it's like right where it needs to. So it definitely has a good feel to it as far as that goes. And then as far as the bending, whoop, I just fell with my motorcycle. But yeah, the bending seems to be working really, really well as far as that goes. So setting and steering on the motorcycle, it's really, really good. And now the truth. I've contacted the service to send me these for free for a review and I didn't get nothing from them. Uh, they should trust their product because this seems to be a very, very good product, but their social media department, whoever is in charge with it, they absolutely suck. Luckily, they have a good product, and I uh, actually give them a positive review as far as this goes because these are really, really good. So because they did not send them to me for free and because this is my personal opinion, uh, the great thing about it is that um, I'm not lying. I'm not uh, motivated by money and other things to to say this and because of that uh, I'm actually quite happy for these for $44 uh, Amazon but I, they were shipped from Caporal Motors uh, in California and for $44 uh, they seem to be very very good plastic as you are used to uh, a service plastics for your bike uh, thanks for watching let me know what you think stay subscribed to the channel uh, I'm going to bring you a review after I ride with them for the first time but so far these have more protection here in the front which was more important for me so uh, i am actually quite impressed by the quality of these things these are knee guards these are not knee braces i'm still working on a pair of good knee braces see if i can get my hands on but for now this is as good as it gets thanks for watching